know they gotta chill I pull out the tool, I may pop for real I've been running bad like I got the steel What's going down, Clutch? What? what up, what up, what up? It's your boy Dub. It's your boy Ross. And we're out in the Clutch. Hey. hey. Back at you, ladies and gentlemen, with another Vigi, you feel me? Jeopardy's funniest moments. Rest in peace, Alex Trebek. Yeah, man. Um, we found out about this earlier this week. Yes, sir. Uh, I think he was um, battling, uh, I'm not sure what type of cancer. Um, I think it's pancreatic. I'm not sure. Comment down below. Let me know. But I know he was in a, a battle with cancer. And unfortunately, he ended up losing that battle. But nevertheless, man, if you grew up, it didn't even matter what household. It, 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 it was always at, it was on, on somebody's TV, Jeopardy, at some point. My grandma Facts. always had Jeopardy on. And it's just, you know, I didn't really just watch it. But, you know what I'm saying? You appreciate it. You know, the times that I would sit down. It'd be like, damn, bro, these... These motherfuckers are smart. You know yeah, what I'm saying? That's like, what I got out of it. Like, damn, man, I don't even know half these answers until it's a, a, a title that I get. Yeah. Like, All right, come on, let's do this one. But yeah, so he was definitely a legend, man, and definitely kind of shaped a lot of the people's home. Like you were saying, mm-hmm. bro, as a youth, if it wasn't the stories, it was this or uh, what was that? Um, Will of Fortune. Mm-hmm. Will of Fortune. Um, He's still doing it too. He's still hosting it. Uh, I forgot his name. Uh, that does Will of Fortune. He's st- he been doing it for a long time too. Nah, um, I thought Drew Carey took over that. That's you think of Price Right. Price is over. right. I'm yeah, tripping you. Right. No, Price is right. Will of Fortune is Price yeah. is right. Mm-hmm. Price is right is the one I was talking about. Mm-hmm. Um, Get your dog spayed and neutered, all that stuff. So. Yeah, bro. So once again, rest in peace, Alec Trebek, and sure, uh, send condolences to his family and loved ones, man. But we're gonna, do, we're gonna, gonna check out some of his funny, some funny moments from Jeopardy, just in the uh, remembrance of 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 him being a fantastic host for the show for so many years so let's check it out let's go in 1814 this vp from See? massachusetts for whom a political term is named died in office having served less than two years arthur who is it? jerry it's pronounced gary but it's gary. elbridge gary well the gerrymander is i know okay that's why it's one of those <laughs> weird things about okay. our language Go again. Zachariah <laughs> predicted the new king would arrive in Jerusalem on one of these animals. And Jesus later does. Lara? What is a camel? No. Come on, Tim, okay. what is a donkey? We'll accept a donkey. It was an ass. <laughs> Here's the clue. In area, it's an the ass. largest former Soviet republic after Russia. And the largest nation we should do our own that Jeopardy. doesn't border an mm-hmm. ocean. 30 seconds. Good luck, players. Yeah, classic, man. Y'all remember that guy that was like on there for like a month straight, just racking up money? Yeah, I remember and that dude. The dude was going in and he just kept winning. <laughs> he just, he was good with it. She on other answer. Oh, she confident. Oh, yeah, she confident. She been us. Lauren, we come to you first. You had 4,800. Which country did you come up with? You picked the Ukraine, and sorry, that is incorrect, so it will cost you something. You wagered 4,000. You dropped down to 800. Damn. Let's what you wager that much? Chris, over to you. You had 9,700. You were in second place, and you wrote down, what is Kazakhstan? You are correct. Mm. And you will add 4,701. Okay. She knew what she was talking about. puts you in the lead by a dollar as we wow. come to Greg Buzzer. Who no. Wrote down, what is Kazakhstan? Greg, as you know, normally <laughs> we don't penalize you if you misspell a word. But in this case, you have changed the pronunciation of the country. So <gasps> it is incorrect. And it will cost you oh, 6,600. Oh, second place. Brian Chafee is our she champion. I mentioned two of our players have uh, done me. Spell. You've done me in college. You you I wouldn't old. put it that way, Alex. Oh. But I, I was in because I didn't, I didn't play you in the game. You had a dollar <laughs> looking solid to me. What did you come up with? What is Kiebert Zilla, which is Alex Trebek backwards? I heard that sends you back to another dimension. <laughs> sends me back where? Another dimension. To another dimension, yes. I will go back to another dimension as soon as we deal with the other players. Have you have tried. no money left. <laughs> Not edible fruit term, 800. This. 
Samira. What is a raspberry? That's it. It's chapter 18, he gets <laughs> advice from his father-in-law, Jethro. Ryan? Who is Moses? Yes, and you're in the lead with a thousand. I'll take starch with Feb Trebek for two... <laughs> what? Barely flexing here. What? I don't know what that thing is. 200. Oh. Catherine Hardy, the newcomer on our program today, has something in common with Anne Boleyn. Both of you spent at least one night in the Tower of London. Tell yes. me about it. Actually, I paid off a beef eater you did? To, to stay there. Yeah, I, I don't know how much it was, but you know, I just grabbed money from my purse and stayed in there. And where did there. you stay? I stayed in the chapel where Anne Boleyn actually got beheaded. Or she, she's buried, her head is buried. <laughs> What's your story, right? <laughs> She was beheaded outside. Yeah. Okay. okay. Oh, Good. bro. This All right, is, Alisa. He Ford was on his stuff, bro. Snap you. What kind of weird ass huh? shit was that? Catherine, what am I doing here? Kat, well, <laughs> you're Alisa. Tower of <laughs> Just went along with it. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Just wanted to make you feel good. <laughs> it's like, okay, sure, yeah. <laughs> I did know <laughs> what to do. Let's together. start this again. <laughs> Let's get these cue cards together. I'll explain what happened to the people here. You were asking uh, how much of the material I know. I don't even know where the hell I am today. <laughs> uh, Catherine, what you should have said was, isn't that interesting? Elisa slept in the Tower of London, too. Damn. <laughs> wow. What is it? Is that a dick? No. I know nothing about a dick tree, but there is a gum tree. Is George the Fourth. No. Oh, yeah. George the Third. Oh. George. <laughs> this term for a long-handled gardening tool can also mean an immoral pleasure seeker. Ken. What's a hoe? <laughs> no. <laughs> I, knew he was, I knew he was about to say it. French. For so ham from Rochester, <laughs> a pygmy goat in college. Did. Why? Uh, for the cuteness factor. Yeah. Well, there are a lot of other things that are cute. How about a little cat? I had a little cat, and one time my little goat, ate, goat ate a chunk of it, her fur. She didn't enjoy that. Oh, no. Billy also enjoyed eating a lot of things, like a three-wick candle, an entire bag of Hershey Kisses, and unfortunately, he met his demise by eating a bag of Quickcrete. <laughs> wait, wait a minute. Was it a 60-pound or an 80-pound bag? Because... Alex, you're being insensitive. <laughs> <laughs> you got a kick you're out right. of it. You're right. <laughs> I still want to know. Uh, right. Would... AJ, I don't want to talk to you. <laughs> uh, who's in charge here? You have command of the bull. Is the category for final. Players, here is the clue for you. A Christian hymn and a Jewish holiday hymn are both titled this. Also the name of a 2009 Tony-nominated musical. Believe, and you have 30 seconds. This. Good luck. It makes you feel like you don't know shit. Like, yeah, bro, it do. Now over to sneakers got one dollar, bro. <laughs> what is <laughs> Kinky Boots. Yes, indeed. Kinky boots. Oh. Uh, word origins, 1,000. Take a whirl on the dance floor under these lights whose name comes from the Greek for the act of whirling. <laughs> and you see them in a lot of bars and nightclubs. Strobe lights. <laughs> I've never heard of, but it doesn't sound like fun. I think it's very fun. It's called nerdcore hip hop. It's nerdcore hip hop. <laughs> yes. Um, it's uh, people who identify as nerdy, rapping about the things they love, video games, science fiction, having a hard time meeting romantic partners. You know, <laughs> it's really catchy and fun. <laughs> Losers, in other words. Well, <laughs> you were on this like a shot. You started writing immediately. Let's see if you came up with the correct Those response. Losers. You wrote down, what is a British invasion? And you are right. What will that do to your score? 1398 added, almost doubling. Too bad okay. you didn't have more money. <laughs> so, more Rubicon. Daria? What is rotunda word? <laughs> no. Bad news God for Brad damn. and Negative. Stephanie. This was not one of our greatest days. Both of you figuring in the red. 
and uh, at the end of double jeopardy that means you're not around to play in final jeopardy so it's they owe you, you all by yourself chris i think you're going to win the game yeah <laughs> that's it how you handle this final jeopardy category the u.s <laughs> government think it's in the negative bro. Beer like yo you can't even play you gotta pay them <laughs> Pay me for being on this show. It's hard. I mean, it is hard, bro. Just really? knowing this information. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our show. I was informed backstage a few minutes ago that our three contestants, Ken, Brad, and Jerome, wanted to relieve some of the tension, and they said we must do the program without trousers. Um. Now, can we get a camera behind to make sure that they have done the same as I? Oh. All right, here we go. <laughs> wow. They left him hanging. It's a wrap for 800. It's a wrap. Don't push me because I'm close to the edge. I I'm can, trying not to lose my head, wrapped this pioneering Grandmaster. Eric. Where's Grandmaster Flash? Correct. Uh, it's a wrap, 400. Wait. I made the change from a common thief to up close and personal with Robin Leach. I want to be on this part. This notorious guy. Mary. Who is Notorious B.I.G.? Yes. He's giving them the answer. 1,200. Another plane, another train, another bottle in the brain. The Beastie Boys wrapped in no sleep till here. Eric. What is Brooklyn? Brooklyn, correct. You have three clues left up there, Mary. It's a wrap, 1,600. Oh, they they did but a G thing. <laughs> this doctor wrapped, never let me slip, because if I slip, then I'm slipping. Mary. Who is Dr. Dre? Yes. <laughs> it's a wrap, 2,000. They know they <laughs> see you go ooh and ah when I jump in my car. People treat me like this Hall of Fame L.A. Lakers center. Mary. <laughs> Who's Kareem Abdul-Jabbar? <laughs> yes, and I don't know why that's... A look at the score. <laughs> that's Sean funny. Sean Connery currently sits at negative $3,000. And your mother currently sits on my face, Trebek. Dr. <laughs> <laughs> Cooper, he's looking pretty God happy. God damn. Why did he come up with Ike? Dwight David Eisenhower? No, I didn't. You didn't. Same guy, some guy in Norbit, but I just won for 75,000. <laughs> yeah, that's clear. Go. Go that's clear. Million dollars at stake in this tournament, and if you win it, you're going to spend a lot of it mm. to work on a documentary. What's the documentary about? It's, uh, it's on sweatshop labor and... In the, our country? Uh, in our country and around the world. Um, so I went to Bangladesh about 10 years ago, and toured a garment factory and I thought what if what if I saw a shirt that I was wearing being made by these people and so it's to try to put a face on who might makes our clothes and I maybe hope. you can find out the names of the eight-year-olds who made your fancy suit there Alex yeah. oh. Oh. <laughs> if Andy Christ. yearns for Brenda and Brenda cares about Charlene who pines <laughs> for Andy the three of them form one of these Kara. What is that, threesome? <laughs> mm. <laughs> hey, I like it. Right what is a love triangle? Yes, that's it. <laughs> what? A better way to say it. Oscar nominated songs, and here's the clue. This song from a 1999 animated film about censorship had a word censored from its Oscar performance. 30 seconds, players, good luck. Talia, this wasn't your day you were struggling but you came up with this as your response for final. Let's see. What is the love ballad of Turd Ferguson? P.S. <laughs> Hi, Mom. Nope. Sorry. <laughs> Missy, start. I'll take TV she shows, theme it. songs for 400, please. Sunny day, sweeping the clouds away. Missy. What is Sesame Street? Correct. I'll take TV shows for 800, please. <clears throat> Our whole universe was in a hot, dense state. Then, nearly 14 billion years ago, expansion started. Bonita. What is the Big Bang Theory? Correct. Mm -hmm. uh, TV shows, 1,200. Oh, Friendly yeah, faces work. everywhere. Humble folks without temptation. Larry. What is South Park? Yep. Damn. TV shows, 1,600. Who's that girl? Who's that girl? It's Jess. Missy. What is New Girl? Correct. Damn, and I'll take TV shows for 2000. <laughs> what would we do, baby, without us? Missy. What is Family Ties? Yeah. Damn, man, she was on it. To the she was. Of this planet, decades after his father's death. Josh? What is Uranus? Nope. Sean? What is Neptune? Yes, his dad discovered Uranus. All right. <laughs> X-rated. Racy humor. What are we doing? The birds and the bees. Your mama. 
and curse words. Oh my. We're going to oh go off the air. I right. Know. He said we're going to get off. Alex, I'll take your mama for 400. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> Ball for 200. <laughs> take a look at me. Use this device to really get your point across. AJ? What is a megaphone? You are right. No, you're not right. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say. In love with what, his what is a bullhorn? Bull How do you not know that? <laughs> the category is bull, AJ. <laughs> oh, man. Once again, RIP Alex Rest Trebek, in peace, man. man. It's, it's, it's 2020 has been a crazy year, man. It's we've, tough, man. We've it's, been losing a lot of great people. I feel like 2020 has been its year. You know what I'm yeah. saying? I just think people have had the time to actually sit down and no, focus and notice what's going on. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm one of those people that feel like the year's just been any other year. You know yeah. what I'm saying? It's just, you know, we got to sit down and watch it all. 2020. Thanks. Thanks. <laughs> but now, uh, rest in peace, man. Definitely a legend. Um will definitely, he'll truly be missed mm-hmm. um, for all his antics and funny Jeopardy ways. Um, again, it was one of them shows that was always on. We just wanted to pay our respect by checking it out and uh, letting you guys know that we used to rock with it. Tell us some of your fan- funny uh, Jeopardy moments that you witnessed or seen when Facts. it was coming up, or maybe in the recent years when it was, you know, you was still catching some of the shows. Mm-hmm. But now we love you guys, man. Make sure y'all staying safe out there in them COVID streets. We love you again. You know what I'm saying? We never want that to go unnoticed. Uh, the love is here and the love is real. Appreciate y'all always. Never forget. We're in a clutch. Already. I've been through this, been through that, reminiscing on my past. I found bliss in the way that I carry on my back. Let my soul sing my song. It goes, ooh, na, 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 na. I still rose from all my lows. I say, ooh, na, na.